Okay, starting over. Here's today's In Touch Devotion. Today's scripture reading is Mark chapter 10, verses 46 through 52. Then they came to Jericho, and as Jesus was leaving Jericho with his disciples and a large crowd, a blind beggar named Bartimaeus, the son of Timaeus, was sitting by the road. When he heard that it was Jesus, the Nazarene, he began to cry out and say, Jesus, son of David, have mercy on me. Many were sternly telling him to be quiet, but he kept crying out all the more, Son of David, have mercy on me. And Jesus stopped and said, Call him here. So they called the blind man, saying to him, Take courage, stand up, he is calling for you. Throwing aside his cloak, he jumped up and came to Jesus. And answering him, Jesus said, What do you want me to do for you? And the blind man said to him, Rabboni, I want to regain my sight. And Jesus said to him, Go, your faith has made you well. Immediately he regained his sight and began following him on the road. Time is precious. It's a tremendously valuable gift that we can give to others. And Jesus showed us how to manage our time well. One important way he demonstrated his love for mankind was by being available. The Lord had much to accomplish in his few years of earthly ministry, but wherever he went, he was sensitive to the needs of the people around him and reached out in love to help. Today's scripture passage records an event that occurred shortly before Jesus went to the cross. He stopped to help a poor blind beggar, a nobody in the eyes of society. Although the redemption of mankind was vitally important, the Lord cared enough about the suffering of one person to stop and provide relief. If Jesus stopped on the way to the cross in order to help someone, will he not also stop and listen when you call out to him in your distress? He's never too busy to listen to one of his beloved souls made in the very image of God. So remember, those of us who are believers are stewards of all that God gives us, including our time. How can you, like Jesus, reach out in love today? and give someone the gift of your availability.